hello in last video we see that we add here chat out button and now we are going to do a chat out process so first i explain you after this chat out button we have to uh, give process to user can login and if user already not uh, registered user then we are forwarding the registration page after registration and login user uh, will uh, verify uh, his or her shipping address after then user can uh, give payment using paypal oh yeah here is the spelling mister sorry for that uh, payment using paypal here we implement payment gateway uh, from paypal and then we will generate order so this is the process but uh, first of all we have to do this process login and register process so we need to create one table registration table so i am going to create here one registration table then we are uh, creating one registration page and after then login page and then the uh, that bot page we are uh, we will connect uh, with this checkout process okay so here right click add new table and i am going to create, uh, create registration page id integer then we need first name where here last name where here email where here password where here address where here city where here state where here pin code where here and mobile where here now here we are going to add a right click and primary key then we clear click on this and we need to add auto increment so click here and drop down here now click here identity specification and click on this and select yes is identity yes now control s and i am going to save this table with registration okay so our table is created and now we are going to create one page inside this user folder registration select master page add user user master okay so we are here now we need to take text box table tr td first name then t td here we are going to take asp text box otherwise you can see that text box from directly here from toolbox text box drag and drop cut here so this tr from first name now copy and paste then take last name again copy and paste email if you need to login using pass uh, username then you need to take one more field username but right now i am going to uh, use email so user can login using email and password password now we need to take your address now city now state
and now pin code and now mobile number and now we need to take one button td correspond to align center and now here we need one button in text is register now after this button we need one more td more tr one td correspond to align center this um, uh, we are going to take here one label for uh, after registration successfully we want to give here one message so we need to take label label and we don't want any types of text so i remove this text okay now control kd and i'm going to run this page yes we have here on registration page now for this address text box we need multi line text box for this address so right click property and here text mode multi line and now we can do like this yes so we did we did here multi line text box and now we are going to perform insert query double click on this button and now here we need to perform insert query so first of all we need to a library using system dot data using system dot data dot sql client and now here sql connection con is equal to new sql connection now at the red sign and we need to pass here our database path so right click here and properties now copy this and paste this now here we need to give connection open connection close then SQL command CMD is equal to connection dot three at command CMD dot command type is equal to command type dot text CMD dot command text and here CMD dot execute non query and now we need to pass here insert query insert into insert into registration values and we have already 10 fields but id is auto increment so we do not need to pass over here so we need to pass here nine fields so i'm going to pass here one two three four five six seven eight nine okay now double quotes double quotes double quotes okay your pattern should like this single double double single quotes and between plus plus sign plus 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 i will show you very easy method for beginner level so you can easily perform this okay 
now we are Tets parts one dot text, Tets parts two dot text, Tets parts three dot text, Tets parts four dot text, Tets parts five dot text, Tets parts six dot text. Tets bot seven dot tets. Tets bot eight dot tets. And here, tets bot nine dot tets. Okay, so we had here nine tets bot six. Now I am going to run this page. First name Amit, last name Andipra. Amit dot Andipara at the gmail dot com password one two three four oh yeah we need to do your password fill so registration dot sps password right lead property and here we have to use password fill okay I am going to run again we need to put your validation also but in last we are going to add your validation right now it is not needed Amit Andipra at the red gmail dot com password ABC one two three address behind Bit Bazaar Maruti Okay, city Rajkot, state Gujarat, pin code three six zero 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 five double nine two five zero one double zero five one. Okay, and I am going to register. Now we will check inside the table. We get record or not? Oh yeah, we get here record now. After registration page, we need to clear all text box value and we give message. So here we are going to pass text box one dot text blank copy paste 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 Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And now here we need to pass level one dot text is equal to registration successfully. Okay, now we are going to check again. A A A A A A at the red gmail dot com A A S S S S and register. Okay, our text box is blank after this session. Immediate your message registration successfully. So this way we can use registration page inside this shopping cart project. In my next video, I'm going to show you how we can make login page inside the shopping cart project and after then we are going to add this registration and login page with this our checkout module and then we are going to perform payment gateway and everything so please watch all videos so you can easily understand how you can perform this shopping cart project fully thank you so much for watching my this video and next video we are going to perform login page thank you so much again if you like my video then please share it so maximum people can use this and please like it thank you so much